Hey guys, what's going on? It's Dunbar Snack Bar here with something different. It's not sports. It's not a shooter. Nothing like that at all. That's right. It's Star Wars The Old Republic. I put a little poll on Facebook to see if you guys would want to see something like this or any MMO really because for whatever reason I was really, really craving to play an MMO since I haven't done it in a long time. You guys decided the Old Republic, so here it is with the Dunbar Snack Bar. That's him right there. I told you guys, like, the whole Dunbar Snack Bar thing came from, like, a whole thing that me and my old roommate kind of put together. And, like, we kind of made, like, stories about them and stuff like that. And I just thought it'd be kind of cool to play this as Dunbar Snack Bar. I will probably be striving to be the worst Jedi ever as I am playing as a Jedi Consular. So... That being the case here, this game's a little bit different. You got live cutscenes. So what I'm gonna do is periodically, like right now, I'm gonna cut away so you can hear what goes on. Ah, Padawan. I heard your shuttle arriving. I am Master Seo Bakar of the Jedi Council. Welcome to Tython. This is the ancestral home of our order, where the Jedi first came to be, and where our most promising Padawans complete their training chance to see where the first Jedi walked. Trained where they trained. It's quite an honor. So eager. You and your new master should get along nicely. Your instructors tell me that even in childhood you had a remarkable connection to the Force. We haven't seen such power in decades. I was hoping your new master would be here. Yuan left her dig site and is returning to Tython specifically to train you. It sounds like Master Yuan's putting a lot of faith in me. We haven't even met. Trust in your initial training, and never forget the Jedi Code. There is no emotion, there is peace. There is no ignorance, there is knowledge. There is no passion, there is serenity. There is no chaos, there is harmony. There is no death, there is the Force. This is... Yuan, I was beginning to worry. So you've arrived safely, my Padawan. I'm sorry I can't greet you properly, but we already have a crisis on our hands. I'm at your service, Master. Tython is a treasure trove of ancient Jedi relics. Recently our researchers uncovered several teaching holograms, but they've not been fully studied. These holograms may be records of the founders of the Jedi Order. They're absolutely irreplaceable. But a large group of flesh raiders has begun rampaging through that region. Those priceless holograms are in danger. Is there a way to protect the holograms? Someone must slip past the flesh raiders to recover these holograms projectors. I intend this to be the first task of your training. No, Yuan. You can't risk a Padawan against flesh raiders, even for such important artifacts. A Padawan who was stronger in the Force at four years old than I was at fifteen? Gifted students need greater challenges. So I must recover these holograms and watch for flesh raiders. Where should I begin? The holograms are in the Narls. Be vigilant. That region has dangers of its own. If you encounter any difficulties, contact me on this hollow communicator. When you have the holograms, meet me at the Jedi Temple. We have much to discuss. Cool. Alright, so here I am, like, rolling in my Escalade. Like a future Escalade. Well, I guess it's the past. A long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. Anyway, so I'm getting to like to the main part here. This is going to be like a little bit of a tutorial, I'm guessing, or something like that, just to kind of get acquainted with some stuff. Now, as I'm kind of going around, I'm like, oh, hey, guess what? I have got a quest. I don't want to. Come here, quickly. The training grounds are not safe today. Tell me what's going on. I may be able to assist. You're Master Yuan's Padawan, yes? Then you've got combat training. Okay, maybe you can't help. The short version is, we have Flesh Raiders invading the training grounds, and a group of Padawans without combat skills is trapped in the hills. Master Yuan mentioned the natives briefly. They are a savage people who occasionally raid the local settlements and devour those they kidnap. Before today, we thought they didn't understand technology. But they're packing blasters and vibroblades and turning them on Padawans who aren't trained to defend themselves. Just let me know what's required. I'm here to help. I've got a beacon here. If you can find the Padawans and set the beacon, we'll send an evac shuttle as fast as we can. A 
group of Jedi from the temple is headed this way, but maybe not fast enough. May the Force be with you. Sweet. Alright, so I'm supposed to go find Padawans that are lost. I think I can do that. But before I do that, let's do some killing. Alright, so obviously I don't have a lightsaber, which is pretty weak. kind of wish that I had a lightsaber, but I guess you can't start off with the best weapon in the entire game. But that's okay, because as a Jedi Consular, it's also one of my strengths here to use the Force. So you'll be seeing like a lot of Force moves and stuff like that out of me here too. Especially as I level up, I'll get some new abilities and stuff like that to be able to show off. Now, this game's looking pretty sweet so far. I think I'm going to enjoy this quite a bit. You guys made a, a good pick. Anyway, I kind of wanted to do the, like where I do the cutscenes too, because playing any role-playing game, you got to understand the story. And, I mean, it's all going to make sense, especially if I'm going to be doing a number of these videos. I want you guys to be able to kind of be in the know of what's going on. I'm playing on one of the roleplay PvP servers, which means that not only do I play out the story, but I also may be attacked by those who are the Sith in this as well. So it'll kind of give it like the most quote-quote real approach. All right, so I come here to the first part, and I find out this Padawan's dead. All right, so these Flesh Raiders mean business. Obviously... They would be if they're called the Flesh Raiders. It's not like because they're wimps or anything like that. Anyway, there's another one down there. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to try and go down there and see if I can find anybody. But anyway, don't worry, guys. For those of you who are wanting to see a Sith character, I'm thinking about making one as well. Kind of do one of each. Uh, just to kind of add to the mix here a little bit. Anyway, so I finally made it to the little cage, I guess. And then there's finally somebody in there. So... It looks like I'll be able to finish this. Okay. Alright, so just trucking along here. So I'm liking that I can like pick stuff up out of the ground and throw it. It like stuns them. So it makes like my other I guess abilities work a lot better since there's a less chance of them being able to dodge it. So you'll probably see me start off with that. And there's my first level up. Pretty sweet. I'm all about that. Gosh, I am liking this game. And Dunbar's pretty sweet. Like I said, my goal is kind of be like the worst Jedi. So once I get past all this and I get around people, you're probably going to see me do some crazy funny stuff just to try to annoy the crap out of people. I don't know why, but it's like whenever I play MMOs, it's like what I've got to do. I just have to annoy everybody. So I don't know. Maybe you'll see me do that a little bit. And of course with this, I kind of want to be the good guy a little bit as well. That's kind of why I started off with a Jedi. I don't know. I just don't like being a bad guy, but... Anyway, free somebody else. And then I got to get these last guys because I skip ahead, of course, for you because I'm not going to have you guys watch every little thing that I do here. And I probably could kill them without throwing that. Anyway, so I finally get last Padawan. So you got to remember, not only was I supposed to find those ones, but I'm also to find somebody else. So now I've got to go around and try and look for them. So I follow on the map here and I find the location where these Padawans are supposed to be. And lo and behold, what do you know? So I'm going to talk with him here and kind of see what's up. How's he looking? He should be resting in the Jedi Temple. But if you're determined to press on, I can help him along. Give him the last of the Kolto if you have to. We'll fight again soon. Hey, good to see another Padawan alive out here. You're lucky those creatures haven't caught you yet. We're talking about the Flesh Raiders? They're hiding everywhere. We came seeking knowledge of the Jedi Code. The Flesh Raiders interrupted our trial. Never fought like that in my life. We killed it, but Jaredin was badly injured. Your friend, how serious is the wound? It pains him greatly. He should not be moving. It is not the Jedi way to seek battle and revenge while a man suffers. That's your opinion, Meneas. It's not what we decided. Training or not, a bunch of animals won't keep us from becoming Jedi. Isn't she right? Jedi don't give up, do they? She is wrong. Remember the Jedi Code. There is no passion, there is serenity. That's enough, Meneas. If you want to help us, we could use you. Help make the Flesh Raiders pay. We're walking a dangerous path. You and your friends need to get back to camp while you still can. But we're so close to finishing the trial. No, we are not. I see you have a signal beacon. Leave it for us, and as soon as we have gathered our things, we will signal for a ride back. 
cool. So you actually come across that a little bit too here. Well, I'll have like light side, dark side opportunities to be able to choose. I'm probably going to try and go light side as much as I can. Just because, like I said, I want to be a good guy. And if I do a cis person, of course then, I'm going to be as much of a bad guy as I can. <laughs> go as dark side as possible. Alright, so here I go. I'm going back to the Jedi Master who kind of, I don't know where I'm going. Who kind of gave me this quest here. So I'll turn it in now. The beacon worked and a rescue speeder is on its way. You really came through for those Padawans. One of them was injured. You need to send a medic with the rescue team. Standard procedure. They're in good hands. You probably want to get back to your trials. Again, thank you. And may the force be with Alright, so I was supposed to do something else here and kind of find these chronicle things. Anyway, here it is. Activation protocol begins. So, after the long silence, finally someone comes. I am Garen Jard. Millennia ago, I stood as a founder of the Jedi Order. For a hologram, you're surprisingly articulate. We needed worthy vessels for our knowledge. When the Jedi Order began, I saw we must be dedicated to peace, to calming our emotions, and ending war across the galaxy. If we fought, it should only be in self-defense. That is the founding principle of civilization. Without peace, there could be no art, or culture, or politics. No republic. The Jedi may have changed, but collective peace has always remained one of our goals. Activation protocol complete. Go well. Cool. All right. So I got the first one. Now here I go finding the second one. You kind of little learn a little bit more about the Jedi with this. Activation protocol begins. Ah, another has come to listen. When the Jedi Order was founded, I, Calabrin, said we should devote ourselves to justice. True justice cannot be driven by emotion. We Jedi can set our passions aside and seek the truth without fear or favor. The projector for this hologram is in danger. I'm here to recover it. Then do what is needed. That too is part of justice. Activation protocol complete. Alright, that was a little bit shorter here, so let's go ahead with the third one. Now remember I have to find four, so this is number three. Activation protocol begins. A new Jedi comes to learn. Excellent. Excellent. I am Ter Sendon, keeper of the histories, a founder and chronicler of the Jedi Order. I saw us becoming guardians of knowledge and secrets. We Jedi would safeguard the wisdom of the galaxy. Gathering such knowledge would be a great adventure. My travels took me across many worlds, more than any other founder. I saw, heard, dreamed. Jedi seek to dispel ignorance, to understand other cultures, and bring that understanding to others. Never forget that, wherever your path leads. Activation protocol complete. Right on. Alright, so here I go, finally finding the fourth one. I had to follow the map to get to it, but anyway. Here we go. That's weird. Nothing's there. So, I guess this is good. That's what I want. Anyway, that's weird. Part of the story, I guess. Master Yuan, I've encountered a problem. One of the holo projectors has been stolen. Stolen? But the flesh raiders don't steal, they destroy. I'll look into this. If you have the other holograms, come and meet me at the Jedi Temple. I'm sending you directions now. And please, Padawan, be careful. Alright, so I gotta head to the Jedi Temple. Which, I just have to follow the map here. And of course, it's not gonna be an easy way to get... I mean, it's not gonna be easy to get there. You can see there's one of the new force powers that I have. Where I, like, get in the middle of everybody. It's like an area of effect type of... Uh, type of attack which is nice to have because a lot of times man I'm going up against a lot of people at once but anyway this is actually quite a lot of gameplay and I uh, kind of narrowed down here of course 
uh, for you guys so that way you're not sitting around watching every single thing that I do because that would probably get a little meticulous but I know this is also very very different than the type of videos that I do which is usually me doing commentary boom I'm usually doing commentary for the entire thing but it's kind of nice um, you know because like I said doing a role play PvP server the story is also important I wanted you guys to kind of get that as well because that's one of the things that I like about Star Wars is, is the story it's usually super cool so a lot of great things ahead coming out of this um, I'm I'm excited because I've heard a lot of good things about this game. Frankly, it just looks super cool too. This is, of course, coming from my PC. Had to do a lot to kind of figure out how to get a good screen recorder, stuff like that. So to kind of do something out of the PC will be nice because I just built the computer and I had graphics and gaming in mind, of course. And here's my chance to really be able to kind of do what I was intending to do and post something a little bit different on here um, besides sports and something that I can do consistently. So I'm going to be playing this off and on, and you guys, of course, be able to get a chance to watch it here. Now, of course, you guys know that this is like the beginning. The planet's called Tython, and kind of give you the background story on it. Apparently, this is where the whole Jedi Order started. So I'm sure I'll find like a lot of historical stuff. And one of the things I like about like the Old Republic type of storylines is you kind of go back and learn a little bit more about stuff that the original... Star Wars movies kind of really didn't go into. Oh man, those guys came out of nowhere. <laughs> I love that move. I can't wait to level up that one. That one's going to be pretty awesome. Because it's like with that one, and then also getting the ability to stun people by picking up and throwing something at them, I think it would be a good combination to kind of go with here to you know, take people out. So, nothing really too challenging so far. It's not like I've gone up against a boss yet or anything but I mean it's still really early so they're probably not going to throw a noob like me into all of this alright so turning the corner here I'm getting uh, kind of close to the Jedi temple up oh, I guess I gotta take these guys out here before I get to them and I still want that lightsaber I've got a it's called a vibro sword or like a training sword basically is what it is so I'm sure I'll I'll get that here before I leave. But I think when that happens, like it'll really pick up and this game will be pretty sweet. Alright, so going down the hill, I finally made it to the Jedi Temple. Now remember that's where I'm supposed to go. So I'm gonna leave here for this episode, and then I'm gonna come back with the next episode and kind of pick up where we left off so that way you guys get the whole story. But I appreciate you guys watching. Like I said, more to come. Uh as always, I hope you guys have a good one.